Okay, this is Rosa from Rosa's Resources. I'm here at the Baltimore Hair Show, the Broner Brothers, um, and I just met this wonderful couple. They're married and they're in the industry together. So we're gonna start with the husband. Why are you at the Broner Brothers show this evening? Well, my concern is continuous education, not only with myself, but with the people who I communicate with, and especially my staff. That's why I'm at the Broner Brothers Hair Show. And I've been following the Bond and Brother Hair Show since the 70s, when the show was basically in Atlanta. It was not in Maryland or any other places. And I know the father and the founder of the Bond and Brothers Hair Show, Mr. Bronner, Nathaniel Bronner was his name. The show was only held in a hotel, the Hyde Regency Hotel in Atlanta, Georgia, in the 70s. It was a great show, and it was thousands of people who were attending that show, and that was the basis for the show to expand it for what it is today in the numbers of the 60,000 people attendance in Atlanta. I'm proud to be here today because I learned what I, want, I need to know. Okay, okay, and this is the wife. And you guys have a salon together, correct? Yes. Okay, tell us about that. Uh, our salon is Metro Hair Station, and May the 1st, we've been there 22 years. And it's in Capitol Heights, Maryland, 1480 Addison Road South in Capitol Heights, Maryland. And both of us uh, have a, uh, we've had apprentices over the years that we've been there. We've seen uh, our stylists go on to own their own salon because we practice what we preach and we preach what we practice. Oh, I love it. And, and go ahead. I'm sorry. And I know the husband was showing me the card that he has. Um, I know New York, we have a different license, but um, he was showing me. Could you hold it up, please? This is his professional license, he said. It's a senior license. Tell us about that again, please. Well, a senior license is not senior based on age, but senior license is a second examination that you have to take outside of the regular cosmetology license. It's a very detailed examination, and a lot of people can't pass it. But this license allows us, or myself, and my wife, of course, has the same license to train apprentices, own a school, teach in schools, and also be be consultants for the hair industry in the state of Maryland. And you guys are doing hair so long, you said since the 70s. Do you still love it? Yes. Yes, it's, uh, it's, some, it's, a, field of, it's a field that we're very passionate to be in. And of course, we've been in the other fields. Myself, I was in federal government for 32 years in which I'm retired. And one of the areas that I worked in was the Bureau in Grading and Printing where the money is printed in Washington, D.C. Wow, okay. And we also had a salon at that time, 16 stations, two different buildings. Okay, and let me just tell everybody, this is Rosa from Rosa's Resources. I'm loving this right now because they've been in the industry for quite a while. They still love it, still have the passion. This is what it's all about, and I hope, and I know that they paved the, the, um, the way forward for a younger stylist. As you heard, they said other stylists went on to have their own salon. So tell me about Rosa's Resources. Rosa Rosa's is, Resources is fantastic. It's, it's good to be here to have met you. And thank you so much because you know we know that when you look good, you feel good. Absolutely wonderful. Rosa's Resources, we're out. Goodbye. Thank you, Rosa. Thank you so much. Have a great, great evening. And thank you, you too.